What's going on ladies and gents, Dalib, we're here for T3G and today we are reviewing the Cyber Acoustics 30 watt powered speakers with subwoofer for PC and gaming systems in frustration free packaging. The packaging was pretty frustration free come to think of it, so that at least is true. Now as you can see here, the speakers go for $39.95 on Amazon and that's where I got them of course. Uh, I needed something to replace my soundbar that I was using and uh, this was within my price range and Cyber Acoustics is, is okay as a brand that I've known and 30 watts is basically all I need for down here. I'm not trying to bring the house down. You, know, you, you see here all the pictures, they've got all the cables really clean, edited, out, and it looks like it's just a really nice choice for something that's not going to take up a lot of space and it does, isn't going to have a lot of clutter. I mean, really, this is the image they show. Let me tell you, this is never going to happen. You're never going to use these speakers that way. Let's get into this. Now, I'm not saying these speakers are bad. I mean, you've got the subwoofer. It does a pretty decent job. It comes with the two speakers and, of course, the controller. The speakers are unremarkable. They're pretty decent for what you're going to get out of them. Uh, they have kind of an overall tinny sound. I'll show you guys a sample of that in a second here. <laughs> The real star of the show is definitely the controller. Uh, it's got a on-off switch, which is really nice. It's got a headphone jack in, uh, or headphone jack out, I guess, and an auxiliary in, as well as a bass controller, which is beautiful. Plus, you've got the really nice uh, dial on top that controls the volume, and it actually lights up in the middle of that dial around the center ring when it is powered on. The biggest thing is this set is entirely cable too heavy. Uh, you've got about 27,000 feet of cable with this. That may be an exaggeration, but I make no promises. Overall, I'm not saying it's a bad set of speakers. They do have a decent sound overall. For my purposes, they do the job. But I'm saying don't always kind of expect less of a clutter just because it looks like it might be on Amazon. Overall, decent sound, except for the tinniness, kind of weird mix of highs and lows. Uh, I think it really only sounds good when the bass is all the way up. If you turn the bass down, the vocals, if you're watching a video or something like that, they get really tinny and metallic. So that is def that's definitely not the way to go with these. These are kind of a jam out, turn everything up to 11 kind of situation and have fun. I would say they're a decent buy. I think if you have maybe 10 or 20 more dollars there's a few other options out there that might serve you better appreciate you guys for watching as always i've been dalibor for t3g we'll see you next time Hello.